Hello everyone, welcome to a killer that I've been very, very excited to see released since, since I, I think he looks cool and I think his power is actually insanely cool. And I'll, I'll get into that why I think his power is so interesting and why I already have a, a deep-rooted connection to this killer. But to get over it, it's the Singularity. He's the new killer that's being in the PTB right now. And his power is, and I'm going to pronounce this wrong, Quantum Instantation. Probably pronounce that wrong. Essentially, it looks long, it looks complicated. Let's just cut to the chase. You place cameras around the map that you shoot. If you shoot them again, they disappear. Survivor said EMPs, which is the electromagnetic pulse. And if they use it, it deactivates the cameras for a period of time. On top of that, you can mark people with the cameras. Kind of think of it like Ghostface, but except you're marking them to a camera. You don't have to actually be there. When they're marked, a little bulb appears behind them and you can teleport to them. The EMP also destroys their bulb and I believe survivors around them bulb because it's an EMP it does an area if they have a bulb you can teleport to them and you get overclock mode overclock mode essentially makes it so you teleport right behind them you are faster as it says here in the state walls and pallets are destroyed faster vaulting speed is faster and he cannot be stunned and if you might ask what does that mean he cannot be stunned from what I understand if you stun him the pallet just breaks and he has a recovery time so goddamn quick <laughs> That I don't think it's possible in any other killer. But yeah, so to so essentially say... Uh, that's, that's what he does. He also has a couple perks that I'm going to get into here. This one's called Genetic Limits. When a survivor finishes healing, they suffer the exhaustion for 30 seconds. Very straightforward and honestly probably the best perk here to stop exhaustion. Uh, not for him, but in, in general, in, in the game. Fearmonger is also pretty good, but this with Fearmonger you're not you're not seeing exhaustions like let's just state the fact you're not seeing exhaustions because they're not going to sit off a gen for 32 seconds after healing where they don't even have anything to do the next perk is forced hesitation i think this perk is 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 really good uh for certain killers like myers oni or killers that are just good lethal killers hunters blight when you put a survivor into the dying state by any means all the survivors in a 60 meter area are hindered for 10 seconds by 15 percent which I think is what the clown does. So that's pretty good. I guess maybe as the clown, that's 30%. That, I don't know. Some Matthew. Now this, I I think this logo is really cool. I think this is one of the coolest logos I've ever seen in the game. This and Dragon's Grip are probably my favorite logos. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Quirky stuff. When this perk activates, the next generator you damage is compromised until it is completed. And this is really cool on certain killers. I think like Legion is the one that comes to my mind instantly. But any killer that you know is a normal m1 killer and the generator is highlighted in yellow i think for you when the compromise generator is completed you become undetectable and a seven percent haste which dude seven percent is a lot like you may not think it's a lot it's a lot for 30 seconds then the perk deactivates but you can only have one gen compromised at once so you, you can't have a gen kicking build you can have deadlock, you can have thrilling, you can have scorch hook, but you, as far as I'm aware, but you cannot have a perk that, well, you can, but you get what I'm saying. Like only one gen can be compromised. So you want it to be the gen with the most progress. First thought that comes to my mind is this with deadlock will be the strongest since you know what gen's about to be completed next. Yeah, I think this is honestly a, a quite a strong perk. Now for the other dude, we'll get into his perks later, the survivor. Right now, let's just... Now we're about the add-ons. Let's just get into some matches here and test them out. Just base kit. I'm going to equip his three teachables and yeah, and Amore, of course. And let's get going. Actually, actually, I'm back again from the pits of hell. I wanted to comment on something. Look at this. Look at this. Genetic. Boom. Then I go forced. Boom. Machine. But what's also quirky about this, in case you didn't watch the stream, generator. Right? There's no perk that actually has generator in it. Now we get all the generator perks. Every one of these perks affects the generator, which means our machine perk, yeah, right here, should be here too. That's really nice. And another thing, actually, I've seen not many people mention this or uh, in, in on the thing. There was two characters that were massively buffed in this update outside of this guy. Number one is, is Ghostface. He got a, well, I say massive. It's massive in comparison to how he was before, like like really far before. In case you didn't know, Ghostface had a 30 second cooldown on his power. Now it's 24. Now in this PTB, it's 20. They reduced it by four seconds, which means, and let me let me correct my, my math here. 
if I go to Ghostface, and where the, where the where is this man? If I go to Ghostface, he has a, a add-on that increases that by six seconds, which means for Ghostface, you can have a power that is 14 second cooldown. Oh my god, <laughs> that is so good. And this killer, this next one, major buff, and and that would be Pyramid Head. Now, what is Pyramid Head's buff? You ask. When Pyramid Head hits you with his damned, uh, Punishment of Damned, aka his long, like, woo, you know, his power, you now become tormented. You no longer have to step in the barbed wire. I mean, you can, but just being hit by his weapon torments you, which in, it means that this add-on, Iridescent Steel of Metatron, might actually become slightly more good. It might go from very bad to average. And then be considered bad because it's an area add-on and not like a green. But yeah, yeah, I felt like I should talk about those two. Since I've seen not really anyone mention it. But let's let's get right into the, the matches now. The Thompson House! Oh, that is such a cool animation! Oh my god. Okay. Look, let's just state the facts. We're probably not gonna win this match. I have no clue what I'm doing. Here. I'm, I'm kind of curious. So, hmm, okay, so you can't launch it that far. I'm guessing stuff like that. Can I place one up there? No. I'm sure I can. I just can't get to it. You can teleport through walls. Okay, that's some good information. Okay, so that's that's the animation when you hit. That that's a cool animation. That is a really cool animation. I don't know why this girl loaded into a match then go AFK. Uh, sadly, I do not have the the luxury to be able to really pick and choose who I um play against. Like I mean, this is the PTB. The low times where killers are. Woo! So now, can we place by hooks? Okay. Something great is about to happen. He speaks? Okay. So she... Oh. Oh. Okay, I think you're slower when you first come out. So I'm a bit... We're having a hard time, uh... It seems kind of... Hmm. Okay, those are the EMPs, so they're open right now. Come on, place it in there. Jesus. So what I'm thinking here is... I'm... I'm having a really hard time understanding how to teleport. And perhaps that is a fault of my own. Yeah, how do I teleport here? I'm a, I'm a, I'm a bit confused. Cause I'm, I'm meant to be able to teleport to them. No. I'm, I'm really trying to understand. That. Oh. So this is overclocked mode. I'm getting that feeling. This is really confusing. This is really confusing. I won't even lie. Okay, so you just have to stare at them long enough. Okay. Is that is that what it seems? I'm, I'm getting the feeling that's what it is. So you... Oh, you are so slow when you leave. Okay. I'll pick up this girl instead. I I don't know, man. They're obviously not going to know exactly how to play against this killer. That's a really cool animation. I, I'm really liking this killer. So, if I do this...
And this is overclock mode. Holy, that's fast. Holy shit, dude. And the fact that it doesn't, like, disappear makes it so much stronger. I'm thinking I'm getting a, a slight hang of this. So you don't actually, once a survivor is marked, you don't have any button to teleport. You just teleport if you look at them. Okay, so this one is, is, yeah, yeah, you can see, like, we can still activate it, but we can't. They've EMP'd it, so it's disabled. In case you're wondering what's happening there, I'm just demonstrating it to you. Oh. <laughs> Bruh. I'm right fucking there. I guess, I guess, what do you do if I'm just standing there having a chilly old time? That's really cool. Okay. So you can still, you can still see, see them through the thing. Wow, they've, they've impeded everything. This is where, uh, there's a timer until the EMP fixes itself. This no longer has purpose. That's such a, I love this man's voice lines. Holy shit, dude. This is such a cool killer. Uh, this, honestly, I won't lie, I have not really been hyped for the past two killers. Wesker, uh, or I, I was really hyped for, but I also didn't play, I didn't know who he was at the time. Like, I knew of Wesker's existence, but I didn't know, like, like who Wesker was, if that makes any sense here. These are some cool... Who's having a payday over here? So you lock on is this how you lock on okay so then how, do, how does this work so you wait till the timer is i see so there's a cooldown that when you can lock on someone next i i think this person maybe wants to see the mori i think they're dead on hook right oh no they're not we know things around here somewhere yeah so so one thing that i i feel the need to to maybe point out okay so thing got rid of it is you can't place on the ground. You can only place on walls. Yeah, you can't place on generators either. Who would have guessed that one? Uh, what gen pop? And, and you can get rid of them. I, I feel like I haven't really... Like, like, I can get rid of this one by doing that. I'm gonna keep that one there, because I think it's a, a bit good. I'm assuming you, you can't... Oh, it, it, it does just reuse them. That's really nice. That, that The fact that it starts reusing them is, is really nice. This killer feels a actually kind of strong, I won't even lie. Do you, you want to see the Mori? Yeah? I'm not going to hook you. I, I think I'd rather Mori you. Oh. Nia is uh not having the best of days here. I should thank you for this. Thank you. Okay, so this is overclock mode, in case you're wondering. We're, we're a bit faster. That is so strong. Like, if you if you know what you're doing here, that is strong. I wonder why we're not locking on there. Maybe there's a cooldown on each individual camera and you can lock on. Maybe those are just some side issues. I mean, Ghostface had side issues too. Okay, is any of you actually Moriable? No, you're not. We're really being the kindest fella here, two hooking everyone. But I, I think Shin is that last person's name Shinke? Shinke, Shinke. Bro, you ran right at me. Is Shinkei the last, uh... Thing? What the hell did... Wow! That is really quick. They, they... Okay, so when you're near someone that's infected, you get infected really quickly. What I think is gonna happen here, and I hope, uh... I hope Behavior kind of realizes this. Is I, I do think there's going to be a, a bit of a learning curve with this killer. Wait, 
where where survivors are gonna really have to understand how EMPs are used. So I think the killer's gonna be really strong right now. Okay, let's see this it Mori. Be fast. Possibly painless. That's so cool. Die fast. Please. It is over. over. <laughs> what the hell's happening there, bro? I I do not think that is a uh, I do not think that is how it's meant to look. It, it looked like she had two faces. <laughs> that is so cool, bro. Oh, dude, I, I, I know that I don't think they should do it on every killer. Like, I don't think it's good on. I don't think it would have worked on Knight. And God forbid the Skull Merchant speaks. But I think the voice lines are so cool on some killers. And this killer is one of them. Like, this is so cool. Well, I am. I am having a, a, a bit of a time here. You can remove these. What are they doing? Let's go. No, place there. Okay. That's how we look when we're just vibing, I guess. I see. Hello there! So now this would be strong. So then I just stare at you longer. That is really strong. So this map might actually be really good for this killer. The Coldwind maps might finally have a killer that really benefits from be fast. Possibly painless. From the, the openness. Die. Damn, that's so cool, bro. Yeah, her mask is gonna. Her, okay. It is almost over. Yeah, it seems the. It, I mean, her. She has an interesting mask. Oh, she does some other animation at the end. I'm also. I'm also getting the vibe that. What the hell? Come on. Come on. Okay, that was a bit wacky, I won't even lie. It, it seems a bit finicky. But this is the PTB. Oh. Shouldn't expect it to be 100% perfect. I'm really enjoying this killer though, that's what I will say. Oh! Bro, what the hell is that? What is that, dude? Holy shit. You don't stand- Dude, this man's a- This man's the goddamn devil reincarnated. Let's see- Guys, you do not see anything in the corner. Oh, I guess we weren't in overclock mode. Holy shit. That is insane. That is insane. It will be fast. Possibly painless. So what is in his hand there? It's like a mouth. Yeah, it's like an alien mouth. So I'm, I'm assuming he's injecting the virus. Or it is over. Yeah, there's definitely two faces there. It's, it's, it's two faces overlapping. What I'm going to guess, and this is a hypothesis that I'm making, is... That it was designed around the survivor that came with it, which is a, a male. So it's probably a little bit finicky on some of the female faces. Or, or just other male faces. I'll try it out in a bot match, and I'll put it after the end of the video. What it looks like. Because we're going to do another match. This killer, I've, I haven't had such... Like, this is insanely fun. This is insanely fun. I'm enjoying every moment of this. I'll get right back into the next match. Blood Lodge. This is a bit more of a normal map. Okay, so the EMP crates do take some time to open. I'm trying to think. Okay. I mean, that seems just good. Uh, okay. So I'm just trying to think here, like, like... What are good placements? Okay. 
I see. So there is a distance on how far you can shoot them from. It's not like you can, uh... Go to Narnia, and then... But we can teleport on this guy. That is strong. That we were... S nope. Pallets are, 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 pallets do not, this dude does not do pallets. Okay, so it seems that he moved. Where did David go? Where did David go? Huh. I actually don't know where David went. Perhaps this gen? Yeah, it seems someone's on this gen. Oh, actually, let's kick this gen. Since it might be the one to do the thing. That might get machine learning activating. We can see that that these hooligans are... Uh, okay, it was not that gen. Sad. Ooh, that's tough. Fixing Vortex. Fixing Vortex? Are you now? Mm, that is not a good placement. This is harder. Than it seems. Because you, you... Yeah, when you lose track, you lose track. That is an... That is evil! Fucking EMP dude. I can't believe they EMP'd me, bro. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. I can see her. I'm still. That is an. Oh, dude. That's evil. I'm staring at her. Bro. Oh, no, man. No, man. There's something evil about that. Okay. Yeah, so this one is a bit... I, I think what I'm noticing about this killer... Is, is And what I'm going to notice is the more cluttered a map is, the worse it is. So, so what... So, Mother's Dwelling... First thing comes to my mind. Mother's Dwelling... Awful map. I can already assure you of that it would suck. Now, now this map's a pretty normal map. Right now, we're I think just experiencing symptoms of I don't know what I'm doing. Hey man, I break stuff faster. Dude, might want to be a, a little bit more. cautious about it. Like, I'm fast. I'm thinking, do we have a 3 gen here? I don't... Mm, I, like, Genetic actually... Matter secured. I don't think this killer excels at 3 gens. I don't. Let me explain my reasoning here, at least. Before, like... It will all be over soon. Hmm? Okay. Because that is obviously a, a statement and have to make. But here's my reasoning, is is pushing people really far away. Oh, he, he balls. Okay, so I think this dude knows what he's doing. That's tough. That's tough. I actually want to go after this dude. Yeah, so, so my reasoning is, is, in case you're not aware, um, 
pushing people on, and, uh, like, since this killer essentially, essentially, can teleport across the map really easily, uh, making it so survivors have to, have to go and really run around the map to, to do their objectives might be strong. You fucker got locked on. <laughs> Still did it, nerd. Oh, but that's a shame. Now, I am glad it doesn't destroy them, because the destroying thing would have been a bit sad. That's what I previously thought was going to happen. Uh, I'm doing something here. So, it, okay. So, it, if, if, you're, if it's in front of a hook, it takes a lot longer. It's not impossible, which I think is, is nice, but it, it's a harder. That might not be great. Depends on what I can see here. Oh, that's fine. Someone EMP'd me again. The devils. I'm trying to find him. I'm gonna find him. We actually can mori this dude. I, I'm nothing personal. I'm, I'm just curious. This is the uh, like it, it's a comes from a state of curiosity. Of this is the survivor that ca oh that's a shame. It just ran out. This is a survivor that came with with the uh, the DLC. So I'm curious if the mori works really well on him. Though I'll go after this arena. I guess it is a bit weird. To go after this guy just because of his uh what character he's playing okay so that, that here's the speed boost that we get from from the thing and as we can see that's quite strong that is yeah we'll catch up to her we should at least yeah that's that's nice we wouldn't have done that otherwise that seven percent made a huge difference that's that's really big Ooh, only one gen left. That's really mean. Yeah, this David, he is the devil reincarnated for us. This man's running around with EMPs. Like there's no tomorrow. Which is hurting us a lot. He, he's he, he's our uh, little devil boy. So obviously, where this killer exceeds really well, or what I'm assuming where they... Yeah, that's tough, dude. The EMPs... Uh, okay, she's going right back at me. I don't exactly know why. Is she going for an unhook here? Why would you do this? Okay, let's go after this dude. Uh, it seems... I'm trying to... Okay. Well, we grabbed him. I want to place him in the middle right here. I'm thinking... I Because I think there's two phases. You can kind of see it. It will be fast. Possibly painless. Oh, nice grass. Okay, so, since this is the survivor that came with the DLC, I'm curious if there's a model up there. It is over. Yeah. I knew it. Bro, that's so devious. What is that, bro? What is that? Holy hell. That's evil. We can actually see someone. I don't know where they were. But placing one right here would not be bad. Yeah, so you just transfer through these. I mean, I'm trying to find these survivors. Someone really adamant on disabling... <laughs> My poor generator, or my poor things. Okay, we should do that. I do. Hmm. Obnoxious. Noxious. 
So yeah, th this is what I'm talking about, though, when I say the, the 3 gen thing. It's, uh... Now, this David, again, in my opinion, he seems to know what he's doing the most. Out of anyone here. Yeah, the, the EMPs are ours. Woo! They're definitely strong. I'm kind of curious about how they'll work. Okay. We know David's there. I'm actually going to go after David right here. Someone else is here? Are you Mori boy? You are. Oh, oopsie. Come on, let me Mori you, please. Yeah, she has an EMP. Possibly painless. Possibly painless. That's such a cool voice line. I'm loving this killer. Please. It is over. It's over. Yeah, so it it, it seems to not. I, I'm I'm wondering why it, it seems to work a lot, or it seems to be having Such issues with uh, existence. the other models. Well, I know why. It's probably a mask that goes over it. I'm sure that'll be fixed before the the main release of this chapter. He's somewhere around here. These guys did not. What you wanna? You wanna see the Mori, Fendo? Okay. It will be fast. Also be painless. <laughs> Such a friend. Fast, fast. Please. So it looks like David is going to have it, it working. Yeah, so David... Yeah. So it, it seems to be male models it works. Female models, it's a bit glitchy. If I had to assume why, I'm assuming... Because of the... The... Difference in female, male, how they're designed or whatever. I, I, I wouldn't be surprised if, if just internally... Um, the male and females had different skeletons or or rigs. Cause I I am I mean, you know, makes sense. I mean, they only did the male. I'm sure they'll do it before uh, the release of this chapter. Not that it's a Mori. It's not the biggest deal. But this killer is so fun. This killer is so fun. I love this killer. I'm actually in love. I want to quickly tell you, what it. Honestly. I, I think this man's playing around. I don't think he's actually being serious. But, uh... There's a, a reason I already have a bit of an attachment to this killer. Is, is like two years ago. I think it was around two years ago. I was like, well, what would be a cool killer in the game? And I, could you not... I thought a cool killer in the game would be a robot, um, yeah, he's joking around, a robot that's like kind of fleshy, like kind of like infused with, in my mind, I was, it was a human, it was infused with a human, and it was like a, a robot with like flesh and muscle in it, and his ability was to place cameras and then teleport, uh, to those cameras, and I was like, I mean, what, it, dude? Like, this is exactly what this man does. It's insanity. I, I'm, I'm really happy that an idea that I had seemed to get. No, I never say anything about this idea, but I, I'm happy that something I thought of that I think would be cool in the game actually made it into the game. Yup. <laughs> this man, this man's goofing around. So that's really happy to see. It, it feels really good, and it's why I was so excited for this killer, and why I probably enjoyed this killer so much. Is it's, it's literally an idea that I had. That I thought would be an amazing addition to the game. And I'll see you guys in the next one. I'm going to be doing some PTD, PTB videos in the upcoming days. The PTB will probably be over by half of them come out. Of just trying different add-on combinations and perk combinations on this killer. Obviously, in case anything changes for the main release. I, I, I don't know. I think what we experienced in this match is what a team who has a better understanding of how to play against this killer would look. You know, that David knew how to use those EMPs well. And he did. And he goes EMP and he's just running around with his fucking EMP. But I'm gonna look at the add-ons. I'm gonna look at some perks. And I'm gonna try to think of a combination that would really 
really be good. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.